Commuters who've endured the misery of using Southern, Great Northern or Thameslink trains were teased with the prospect that those companies could be gone and replaced. It's part of some big changes planned when those franchises come up for renewal. Olivia Kinsley is at Victoria Station for us this evening. Olivia, how's this going down with commuters this evening? Well, I think, frankly, very few Southern customers who've been using uh, the service are going to be either shocked or surprised or indeed saddened by today's news because frankly with Govia Thameslink in charge they've been having a pretty miserable time of it. There has been strike after strike, huge disruption, people even saying they've been losing their jobs because of it and uh, they will be hoping now, speaking to pe people here today, they are telling me that they now welcome frankly any change and that this news now brings hope that something could now change for the better to bring an end to this disruption. Now, Govia Thameslink is Britain's biggest rail franchise and the government's critics, uh, namely the union, say that this amounts to nothing more than a further plan by the government to privatise and fragment Britain's railways. Today, though, the Transport Secretary, Chris Grayling, said it's always been inevitable. The size of the Govia Thameslink franchise was always a temporary measure put in place for the Thameslink works that are taking place at the moment. £6 billion investment in creating hugely improved services through London. We're going to see up to 24 trains an hour going through the centre and filtering all across the southeast. So uh, when that programme's in place, we can return to what we had before, which is more locally focused franchises. Well, there is now some suggestion that TfL could, in fact, take over parts of that southern network. The Department of Transport saying it will work with TfL to explore options for transferring selected services, such as the West London line to TfL. Uh, Sadiq Khan and TfL have today both uh, welcomed those discussions. Olivia Kinsley, thank you.